Hello everyone. Today I'm going to tell you how to run Amazon Fire Stick on Roku TV. Since everybody thinks it's a lock TV like T-Mobile and Verizon they have their lock phones you can run only T-Mobile uh, SIM or Verizon SIM on Verizon phone or T-Mobile or T-Mobile phone. So I just bought this 65 inch Roku TV from Walmart Black Friday deal and I just bought this for the first time and I didn't know that if I could be able to run Amazon Fire Stick. So let's start. Hmm. Pretty good colors. Still better. And okay, I already since I already installed Fire Stick, but I'm going to tell you how to do this for the first time. So you don't need to I just saw a video before uh, the guy just show I don't know that guy but uh, I'm just trying to uh, bypass his strategy because he just bought a device and I don't know what device he just bought and he mentioned that you have to buy uh, that box it seems like a Roku box or kind of uh, Amazon Fire Stick box but that box did not have any name so you have to connect your Fire Stick with that box and uh, I mean turn on your Bluetooth and then you would be able to somehow bypass uh, Amazon Fire Stick which is not guaranteed but you just need to go here just port your Fire Stick like this and just plug into the port and just the power cable for television as well come back turn on the TV like I did this screen will come up and then go to the home screen automatically you just need to go e either go up or either go downward it, it brings you it's like a 360 cycle okay so I'm going to do I will first go to settings I will go to TV inputs these that where is Fire Stick app sorry Fire Stick uh, connected on the port 1 of HDMI or port 2 there are I believe 3 so I did it on port 1 so here you so I'm already on the HDMI 1 you can see here and all you have to do is it's already on Fire Stick all you have to do just go to the right rename and you can just customize and rename whatever you want to I already did this Fire TV then OK and then you can choose any icon you want to do OK I already have this one that's all I will go back to home I will go to Fire Stick and I will click OK now here's the thing once you already entered into the uh, once you enter into the Fire Stick you will not be able to use this baby remote you have to use fire stick remote I had an old TV which is uh, the category of Scepter Commodore I bought it for uh, like four years ago and I, it, it was still running better than many of the TV nowadays and I just sold that one and I bought this one and this one seems pretty big and good than the last one I use the same fire stick I'm using just a normal one I use free channels and movies okay let's go on any movie just to make sure if everything's okay and running well okay let's go in a <laughs> any category let's run any movie Greenland one of my favorite this year streaming fast because I have a gigabit net Verizon 
Okay, let's run any of these. I will never recommend. Oh, I already was using this movie before, so I just start over. Yep, it's working good. I just move a little fast forward and then. Okay. It should be good. Doesn't matter how fast your internet is, but uh, when you are watching free movies, it redirect from any third party server, which is which, which could be in any country, <laughs> maybe China, Japan, Korea, US. The volume is on the right side. Yep, that's all. I will just turn off or I will say, Hey Alexa, turn off TV. Okay. Thank you.